Welcome back to Mason Talk. So episode four of Hard Knocks featuring the Cleveland Browns just ended and it was good. It was a fairly interesting episode. The show of course started with Josh Gordon seeing as Josh Gordon is back. But that was really all that we saw of Josh Gordon was that he is back. But that's not really surprising seeing as he, you know, pulled a hammy and hasn't done anything yet. But, you know, he's back, and that's good. We got to see Baker Mayfield getting prepared to be an NFL-level quarterback, getting used to the speed of the game and the pace of the game and just basically, you know, the life of an NFL quarterback in general. And yet he still is not getting first-team reps, which is absurd to me. <laughs> we also learned that Miles Garrett gets to make music demands at practice, which makes sense seeing as he is already one of the best players that we've had in 20 years. Miles Garrett gets to listen to what he wants to unless Bob Wiley disapproves. The Browns rookies put together a video where they imitated other members of the organizations and it was called the 2018 Rookie Show and it was actually it was probably the most entertaining part of the episode. The 2018 Rookie Show was hilarious. We saw some random wide receiver imitate Jarvis Landry Baker Mayfield imitate Carl Nassib and John Dorsey. It was great. And then, of course, we got to see the behind-the-scenes action of the game versus the Philadelphia Eagles. And, you know, it wasn't uh, it wasn't a happy game. <laughs> the Browns, of course, only scored five points in that game. Sadly, the most interesting parts were when... Uh, our players got injured. <laughs> Since Tyrod Taylor is mic'd up, we got to see his live reaction to his hand injury. And it was not good, you know, he, he sounded like he was in a lot of pain seeing as it was a, you know, pretty bad injury. Tyrod Taylor went back into the locker room, he got his x-rays which were negative, and then he was very eager to get back into the game and they let him back in, which is still absurd to me that you would let your starting quarterback with an injured hand back into a game. One thing that Hard Knocks has been highlighting is the relationship between Todd Haley and Jarvis Landry. Uh, they don't get along at all times, but they clearly respect each other a lot. Todd Haley in episode 2, I think it was, was telling Jarvis Landry that he should try to be a mentor to Antonio Callaway, and he was doing that. He was going over film with Callaway, and it was just nice to see our players getting along with their coaches. <laughs> That's always a good thing to happen with your professional sports team. So yeah, all that cool stuff happened, and Devin Kajuice also likes rocks. But yeah, so that was my recap of Hard Knocks Episode 4. Next week is Episode 5, the finale. The cuts, they're coming. People are gonna lose their jobs. My prediction is Nate Orchard is not going to make the roster. Let me know in the comments what did you think of Hard Knocks episode 4. Thanks for watching Mason Talks. Make sure you leave a like on this video and make sure you subscribe to Mason Talks and I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.